right guys, I'm gonna go over real quick how I cape a deer for taxidermy. So I know in the past for myself, I've been on YouTube and different places looking up how to do this because you obviously want if you can all help it, if you kill a nice buck and you want a shoulder mount and put him on the wall, you, you want him to have his own cape. You want it to be as authentically your deer as possible. So it's important that you cape him out correctly so your tax dermis can, can uh, finish the job and give you the, you know, the, the trophy that you want to hang on your wall. So the first thing I do, I'm going to get the deer down, you know, getting split, getting hung, and I'm going to get him down about halfway between uh, where his legs come together and the end of him. So about halfway down his body, so about center gut, I'm gonna split him to there, and then I'm gonna do a ring straight around his body. So I'm gonna cut, I'm basically gonna cut and spin him straight around his body. So we'll have a cut to there. So you can be as fine as you want here, but really you're this far back because you're trying to give your taxidermy plenty of hide for that shoulder. So you don't have to be extremely fine, you just wanna ring him and get as much of this that taxidermy can use to stretch over the, uh, the, uh, the front the form. So the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna ring these legs because you're gonna end up going, we're gonna end up going up and tying into that cut. So I'm gonna find the joint the leg. The next thing you're gonna do, and you want a really sharp knife for this, because this is your most important cut. You're gonna cut right down the brown and white line all the way into the armpit, and then you're gonna go straight up to where you, to your cut where you rung him. You're gonna do that on both sides, and so basically you'll have cuts like this and here. And this will fold down the middle and the back will come off. The most important thing when you're doing this is to make sure you stay on the white. Don't cut into the white and don't cut into his chest area. Get into his armpit and then go up to here. Now that we've done this part, you, you're working him down and then when you get to here, you just kinda gotta go slow and you wanna get it as far down the neck as you can so you can cut him off at the neck. Now that I got it down the neck, we're gonna, you're gonna cut in through that neck rose meat, make a clean cut all the way to the, to the neck bone, and then we'll saw that off. I always like to, when I'm done, stretch it out, take some water, if you like your taxidermist, and clean it up a little bit for him. I like to stretch it out here, and then I'm gonna fold it up, roll it up, sit it down in the back, take the taxidermist, and get your trophy mounted.